Hey guys, Coach Michael Burt, the Super Coach, coming to you live every single week, coming to you today on Monday, live from the Greatness Factory, because I'm about to get on a plane and head to Minnesota, baby. Minnesota, that's exactly right. But what we're talking about today is I'm going to do a short coaching session for you, everybody out there, on a concept we call 2.2 millimeter of strategy change for 2017. They tell us a good plastic surgeon never makes more than 2.2 millimeters of change, and they never make more than seven changes. What if I told you coming in the new year, you can make two small tweaks, 10% and show quantum leaps in your business. I'm Coach Michael Burt and you're watching Super Coach. Hey guys, this is Coach Michael Burt. I am so glad you joined me for Super Coach. I believe a good coach can change your life. I believe a good coach will have conversations with you you don't wanna have, make you do some things you don't wanna do. Help you become something you didn't think you could become. You see, you can't see the picture when you're inside the frame. You can't reach your own potential without the help of another person helping you break through those ceilings of success. I'm Coach Michael Bird, and I'm going to find the kryptonite in your life, and I'm going to do it on this show, Super Coach. Hey guys, Coach Michael Bird, to Super Coach. Welcome, welcome, welcome. To Super Coach every single week. I'm coming to you live on Monday today because I'm flying to Minnesota. Hey, I almost forgot where I was going. You can download this podcast every single week. Stitcher, podcast, Android. And I want to bring you some coaching. I told Brandon, my IT director, let's mix it up a little bit today. Let me get out from behind the chair and let me get into a coaching posture so I can coach some people today on one of the greatest things that we've been teaching for many, many years. I want to give a shout out to a lot of people out there. Will Webb is on here with us this morning. Matt Crane, good morning to you, sir. Owen Schrock, Roy Frazier, David Ross. Uh, hello to everybody out there. I'm going to give you about a 15, 20-minute coaching session on the concept of 2.2 millimeter of strategy change as we go into 2017. And, and before I get into that, I want to talk to you about this concept of seasonal affective disorder. You know, we live here in Tennessee. I know many of you are all over the country. This past week, I flew to Pittsburgh, got caught in a snowstorm. Then I went to Newark, New Jersey, freezing cold up there. But here in Tennessee, it's been, it's been uh, cloudy. It's been cold. It's been rainy. It's been yucky. And what I notice is that people's productivity goes down. See, productivity is about energy. It's about movement. It's about circulation. It's about activity. And so yesterday, I'm sitting in my house. It's completely dark out, 4 or 5 o'clock at night. I'm seeing how everybody don't want to really do anything. Okay, I, I, I'm, and, and I'm sitting there going, why do people go into this funk as it relates to this time of year? And, uh, and I was thinking about some of my life when I was in a funk. I was thinking about one year I was completely single. I ate at Chef Wang's on Christmas Day. All my friends were with their families. I mean, it was a really dark period of my life. I didn't have anything going on. I didn't have anybody I was dating. I didn't have anybody seeing. And I got, I went into a funk. And the seasonal affective disorder, SAD is what it's called, is where people just let the weather affect them. And I was thinking about this trip I'm taking this afternoon to Minnesota. And they said, it's like zero degrees. And I said, man, I got to carry my weather with me. I got to bring the juice. I got to bring the energy. So I wrote this great article on LinkedIn, Facebook, and it said, don't go sad on me this winter. And I talked about, because if you go to a, to a doctor, they're going to prescribe medication. They're going to tell you you need some sunlight, man. They're going to tell you you need some sunlight. What I would tell you is this, you need to get around people. You need to get around energy. Anytime I've been depressed, it's because I didn't see how big my goals were. I didn't get excited enough. I didn't, I didn't push. I let something external from me. People, the weather, friends, family, somebody out there kind of squelch my innate desire for, to push and really drive. And so as we start closing down this year, and you're not finished, I've been on the phone making sales calls all morning. Finish across the finish line. Don't limp across the finish line. But simultaneously, while you're finishing across the finish line and you're getting your ball across the finish line, I want, to th I want you thinking about, as we go into 2017, what are going to be my small shifts in my strategy? Now, we've all heard the saying, what got us here won't get us there. Yeah, every, every new re uh, stimulus requires a new response. The, every significant breakthrough we've ever had in our life was first an old way of thinking into a new way of thinking. We had to break with something old. Well, most people will leave 2016 and they'll go into 2017 and they'll do the exact same thing next year 
and expect better results. Well, if you want to show a 20% increase, 30, 40% increase, you're going to have to shift your strategy. So today's session of Supercoach is really based on this concept of 2.2 millimeters of strategy change. Now, why 2.2? Many years ago, I heard somebody say this, a good plastic surgeon never makes more than 2.2 millimeters of change, and they never make more than seven changes. And I started thinking about, in my own coaching career, when I couldn't win a championship, I had reached a, a ceiling. Now, I'm going to show you the three states that people are in. And when you're thinking about this, there are three states that everybody is in right now as we, as, as we speak. Okay, there's three states... And there's three problems, right? And I write about this in my new book, Everybody Needs a, Co a Coach in Life, because money only changes hands when problems are solved. There's three states and there's three problems. So, so the three states are this. You're in a dynamic state, which means you're alive, vibrant, growing, expanding, taking dominion, moving forward. You are in a static state, which is what we're going to talk about today, or you are entropic. And entropic is slow to disintegration. Entropic is a dying state. And so I step into cultures every single day, that are dynamic. Hey, people around here are alive. They're fresh. They're on fire. Then I step into cultures that are static, right? And part of the reason I'm going to Minnesota today is to work with the company to, to, to keep their culture moving, to keep it moving down the field. We don't ever want to get entropic. So in your own life, I want you to think of it this way. I'm growing, ascending. I have plateaued. I am dying. I'm growing. I've plateaued. I'm dying. And what I mean by that, I, I, I'm not necessarily meaning physically. I mean mentally, emotionally, spiritually. It's almost like the in Revelation, he talks about the church in Sardis. He said, I know your reputation for being alive, but you're really what? Dead. You can be dead inside. And so when you start thinking about these three states, I want you to think about your business. It's growing. It is plateaued. It is dying. So how do we break through that? Well, here's my philosophy. The three problems are like this. Number one, you don't know what to do. That's problem number one. And because you don't know what is your next right move to make, you don't know the next right move to make right now. This is why people need a coach in their life to say, you need to do this, you need to do this, because there's all of these options that we could take. So the first thing is we don't know what to do. And because we don't know, our confidence is low. Our confidence is low. Problem number two is you're successful. So you're looking at your 2016 and you were incredibly successful but you have plateaued. You have hit a ceiling. You are stuck. You are in a rut. Okay? That's the second problem. And this is where the 2.2 millimeters of strategy change came in. See, when I was that high school basketball coach, I plateaued. I plateaued at a sub-state game. I got there two or three times and I got beat and I went home. And so what I did is I sat down with six coaches that had won a championship and I said, please tell me what I'm not doing. They gave me two or three strategies. I went back and changed my strategy just this much. 2.2 millimeters of strategy change. And that very next year, we won a championship. What's those two new strategies for your business in 2017? What's the two new things we're going to be talking about today? And then here's the third state you're in. You're very successful, but you are bored and you're unfulfilled. You want to be involved in something. There's something that's not quite quenching your thirst as it relates to your business. And, you, and you're just antsy going into the year. Maybe you're a little frustrated. Maybe you're a little upset. But you just know that you need to be involved in something bigger. Maybe God's calling you to something much bigger than what you're currently doing. But you just don't know how. So let me give you some kryptonite. We're going to be talking about these things today. Here's kryptonite number one. You've hit a plateau in your business because you can't see the picture when you're inside the frame. Here's what we can't do in 2017. We can't go back out and do the exact same thing we did this year. That's the purpose of today's show. In segment number two, I'm going to give you the 2.2 millimeters of strategy change. I'm going to tell you what my new strategies are, what my new divisions are, how I'm going to generate a couple hundred thousand more of money, maybe a couple million more dollars of money. And then it's about doing one thing, baby. It's about taking action. We ain't got any sad around here. This is Coach Michael Bird. We're bringing the goods. You're watching Super Coach. Come on back in segment number two. Hey, guys. Coach Michael Bird, the Super Coach. Gone are the days where you just buy a book. When you pre-order my new book, Everybody Needs a Coach in Life, my 11th book, my most comprehensive book, let me tell you what I'm going to give to you the minute you pre-order. I'm going to give you five hours of coaching for me on the book. I'm going to give you access to Monster Producer, my biggest coaching program online, live, every 30 days for six months. I'm going to give you access to my Total Growth Academy, over 400 coaching sessions. I'm going to give you seven webinars with me where you can interact with me on every chapter of the book. Go get Everybody Needs a Coach in Life. CoachBert.com backslash new book.
Hey guys, welcome back, Super Coach. Typically every Tuesday, but tomorrow I'm going to be in uh, Minnesota coaching a new company I'm excited about working with today. Uh, this week as we head into the end of the year, I want to give a big shout out to a lot of my friends out there, Owen Schrock, Jason Jones, John Coach Brubaker, Scott Abernathy, Takesha Bromell, Andrew, Phil Griffin, Ivan Velasquez. Look at all these people on here on Monday. Good to see everybody, guys. Good to see you. Everybody needs a good coach in life. You know, a good coach will bring you some clarity. I was doing sales calls this morning, and one of the things I said and shared was that I think a good coach helps you to step back and get clarity. What is your next right move right now? Why are you not growing at the state that you need to grow? Why, why have you reached an entropic state? Why have you reached a plateau state? Well, it could be this. I, I, so in this section, I want to talk about this concept of what do we do to really bust through our plateau. And one of the things I want to show you is that this, I want you to always remember this concept. Any person out there right now could two times their business by working harder. I could come in earlier, I could make more sales calls, I could work on the weekend. Anybody can do that. I tell people you can get on a treadmill by yourself. You don't need a trainer for that. But if you said to me, I would like to five times my business, ten times my business, you can't work your way into ten times in your business, right? It's just not enough. So you can two times your business by working harder, but you can't five times it. You can't 10 times it. Now, we have a coaching program called Monster Producer, and I tell people, you don't need to get in Monster Producer if you want to do one more deal a year. Okay, I, I'm looking for people who want to grow 30%, 40%. When you get up into 50%, that's called hyper growth or rapid growth. And, and some of you are going, no, I don't want that. I don't want that. Do you want to help people or not? Do you want to grow or not? Do you think when Amazon started their business and they begin to grow like crazy, they said, no, we can't handle it? No, they just figured it out. Do you know there was a time when Amazon would literally go over to the toy store and purchase the toys that people were buying to fulfill Christmas orders and fulfill those orders? So, so for you, as you're growing and as you're pushing, you got to understand once you've hit this, this plateau, so what are the three states we in? The three states are real simple, okay? Dynamic, static, Entropic. And so if you've hit this dynamic, uh, this plateau state, you're not going to bust through by working harder unless you're just lazy. And now you need to work harder to get to the next level. Okay? So this is where the 2.2 millimeters of strategy change come in. Okay? When you've hit the plateau. So what does a plateau look like? Stuck, bored, in a rut. You're doing the same number. So my real estate agents, you're hitting 40 deals a year every year. Maybe you did 42 this year. Maybe you did 45. Maybe you did 38. Maybe you make the same amount of money that you made last year. You've hit some type of plateau. And so I want you thinking at this plateau, this is not about working harder. This is about stepping back and increasing the production capacity of our little operation so that we can show monster leaps in our business. So this is where the strategy comes in. And when you're thinking about strategy, it could be a new division of the company. It could be a new problem that you're solving. It could be that you're going to get back to doing what you used to do to be successful. And so when you're thinking about this, let me give you some strategy pushes that, that, that I think happens at this 2.2 millimeters of strategy change. Here's what I think you need, okay? Number one, I think you need some outside perspective. You can't see the picture when you're inside the frame. So what's happening? You're just repeating the same old things. So be like a basketball coach that goes out and loses, but comes back the next time and tries the same strategy. Or a football coach, same strategy. Okay? What about this one? You need to get back to the core. Okay? And I find myself doing this a lot, is I get away from things that made us very successful. Uh, for example, Monster Producer is one of the biggest coaching programs we have. It's a very successful program. It's growing by four to seven people a month. We've got new subsets of the program. My commitment in 2017 is to make that a million-dollar coaching program and then a $5 million and then a $10 million coaching program. But my little mind will get off track on what's the main thing. Remember this, the main thing is to keep the main thing what? The main thing. So sometimes you need some outside perspective. Say, man, you're getting away from what you're great at. Okay? You need to get back to the core. What made you, I can't tell you how many people tell me, oh, I used to do this. I used to prospect Coach Bird. I used to do this. I, I used to call, call people two hours a day. I used to go to events. Okay? You got to get back to what made you great, man. Some of you, your strategies, I got to get back to doing this. I got to get back to doing that because that made me great. And the third thing is you got to come up with two new strategies. And we're going to get into that in the, in the final segment. What will your two new strategies be? They could be small strategy. Let me give an example. 
This past year, we introduced our new online academy. Our online academy is our high in virtual training, and that means every person out there, we can sell to anybody on the planet now. So where's our sales market? Everywhere. Our targets can be literally anywhere on planet Earth. That was one new strategy that brought us a whole new way to sell to everybody. What is yours? So let me give you some kryptonite to get you out of here. You don't know what strategy changes to make. So you choose the wrong ones that are not multipliers. A lot of people come into 2017, they make a little tweak here, a little tweak there, but it's low value. I want things where you exert energy here and get a huge return here. And there are things, we call those things multipliers. You're looking for things that will drastically enhance the business. Now, like I said, we come back in our final segment, we're gonna get into what some of those things were are, and I'm gonna share some things with you that we're gonna be doing at Michael Bird Enterprises to get that 2.2 millimeters of change to go out there and crush our goals in 2017. You're watching Super Coach, and I'm Coach Michael Bird. Hey guys, Coach Michael Bird, and I get asked all of the time, what does a good coach do? See, a good coach should engage you in a set of systematic behaviors that allows you to do something tomorrow you can't do today. They should find and fill your missing structures. They help you break through that ceiling of success that you can't break through on your own. And that, my friend, is why everybody needs a good coach in life. Check out Coach Michael Burt's Total Growth Academy at CoachBurt.com. Hey guys, Coach Michael Burt. Welcome back to Super Coach. New format today. New format. New coaching format. Instead of me sitting behind the desk, how about I get up and get, get start coaching you, man, as if I'm coaching you. And I am coaching you. I want to thank you to all the folks out there in my Total Growth Academy. If you bought my new book, Everybody Needs a Coach in Life, $29.99, and you get a lot of stuff. I think the people in my Total Growth Academy who are on here will tell you what kind of value that we create for them weekly uh, things that I send out to them, strategies that I put out, videos that I send out, access to live events. We're working on one for you uh, coming up in January, a, a live Q&A with me to get your uh, season started off right in 2017. I don't know about you, but I want to crush it. I think we were hardwired to take dominion over our land, to multiply, to grow and expand. And what we're talking about today, for all my people that are out there, Scott Abernathy, Jason Jones, Phil Griffin, Merry Christmas, brother. Eric Hensley, Tracy Tucker, D. Richard Hodges, Travis Perus, okay, Chris Gregory. I want to say hi to everybody out there. Merry Christmas to you. Anybody wants to get on the plane with me and go to Minnesota this afternoon, you're more than welcome. No seasonal affective disorder here, baby. We're going to take some sunshine to Minnesota. i got to find some, but then I'm going to take it to Minnesota. Now, what are we talking about? We're talking 2.2 millimeters of strategy change. Good plastic surgeon never makes more than 2.2 millimeters of change and they never make more than seven changes. What am I asking you? I'm asking you to show some hyper or rapid growth in 2017 to bring me two new strategies that you're willing to try in 2017. Now, some of you are gonna say, I need to get back to what made me successful, get back to my core, because I have a tendency to get away from what makes us successful, okay? Here's some examples of some things that we've done in our company to do that. Last year, we developed a new division of the company called Talent Supply. That's where we onboard new sales folks, okay, in the first 90 days of their employment. Two years ago, I introduced Monster Producer. This year, I'm introducing uh, a new program called Mega Monster. That's for people who earn over $200,000, $250,000 a year. That's a new subset. We're also introducing Monster Insurance, Monster Mortgage, Mega Monster. These are new strategies we're bringing to the market. Okay, and that's what I constantly want you thinking, is that how do I bring new things to the market? Now, here's the, here's the two things I really want you to think of. What new problem can I solve in 2017? Many people have been asking me about accountability. How do I drive accountability? So I've been working on a concept called the accountability engine of how we can drive accountability deep into the, deep into the DNA of an organization. So these are constantly new things. Another thing is I'm going to write some small books in 2017. we got Everybody Needs a Coach in Life coming out in March, but I'm going to write crumbs. I'm going to write The Accountable Church. I'm going to develop programming. We're doing something new for spouses in Monster Producer in January called a vision retreat. These are all 
new things that we're bringing to the market. So let me put it, let me sum it up and put it to you this way. There's a problem out there for your client base that you're not solving currently that you could solve with your skill set. It is in your vertical. You can help solve the problem. People would compensate you to help them solve this problem. How are you developing a solution to some of the biggest problems that you listened to and heard? If you're in the insurance business like Will Well, if you're out there in the car business like Ivan, if you're out there in the world, there, there's problems that you've been listening to all year that you say our company can solve that problem. And we're going to bring a new division, a new wrinkle, a new twist, something new to the market. Just two small strategies. What are your two new strategies going to be for next year? Doesn't have to overhaul your business. You don't have to shut it all down and start over. But you got to bring some fresh, dynamic solutions to the equation. And that's really what this break should be about. So let me give you some kryptonite, guys. I got to go do a coaching session and I'm getting on an airplane, okay? Your final kryptonite for this show today is slowly but surely every year you get away from the most profitable and valuable components of your business versus buckling down and driving them home. I'm certainly guilty of this one. Guys, I've got a commitment of Monster Producer, my baby of getting in there and making this thing a $5 million coaching program before it's over with. I got a commitment to Greatness Factors. We're going to bid all over the country. I got a commitment to go as fast as I can, like it talks about in the book of Habakkuk, of writing that vision down and running toward it. That's my commitment. But the main thing is to keep the main thing the main thing. Get back to the core of what you do best and go out there and kick people's butts and find two new strategies to bring it to the market. You may need to do a better job of marketing yourself this year. You may need to add more salespeople this year, which is what I'm gonna do. You may need to add more staff. You may need to do certain things to just push out there to the market that you just gotta shake it up, man. You can't let yourself get static and entropic. Every single week I come to you, typically on Tuesday afternoon. I'm Coach Michael Burt, live from the Greatness Factory. We believe everybody needs a good coach in life to bring clarity and acceleration and confidence to your life. And we believe a good coach will have those conversations with you that you don't want to have. I'd love to hear your 2.2 millimeter strategy change. Put that in the comments below. I will get back to you or send them to me and let me look at them. But just don't come out and do the same thing you did in 2016. Everybody needs a coach in life, guys. Thank you for letting me be yours. Hey guys, Coach Michael Burt, the Super Coach. Gone are the days where you just buy a book. When you pre-order my new book, Everybody Needs a Coach in Life, my 11th book, my most comprehensive book, let me tell you what I'm going to give to you the minute you pre-order. I'm going to give you five hours of coaching for me on the book. I'm going to give you access to Monster Producer, my biggest coaching program online, live, every 30 days for six months. I'm going to give you access to my Total Growth Academy over 400 coaching sessions. I'm gonna give you seven webinars with me where you can interact with me on every chapter of the book. Go get Everybody Needs a Coach in Life. CoachBurt.com backslash new book.